Uh, my name is Rick Shore. I'm with ODOT. I run our underwater dive team. We're over here today in Florence, Oregon, looking at the Suisala River Bridge on Highway 101, one of the coolest, nicest bridges on the Oregon coast. Architectural treatments that were built back in the 30s and 40s are, we don't build bridges like this anymore, so we're trying to preserve and pr protect these for the future. Making sure the bridge will last longer by doing the underwater inspections. We, we just rip wrapped it, did a scour repair about four years ago. Um, the fender system had failed and they fixed that probably eight years ago. The fender system is all the barnacles and covered in, they're hard to tell what they are, you gotta scrape and to decide what condition they're in. Some of the places you probably wouldn't want to go where we go, but you know, it's, it's, it's not as good as it sounds a lot of times. But we've got about 1,100 bridges that have elements in the waters that we're required to look at. So, so we're busy um, pretty much March through October, November. We're out throughout the state and we inspect all the, all the state bridges, all the city bridges, county bridges, anything that's got piers in the water. Today we got Jason Otteson, who's, he's my partner. The two of us are the full-time divers. As we're swimming around it, we were looking for, like I said, impact damage and major structural cracks. There's lots of submarine cables, old abandoned cables, um, all sorts of things get thrown off the edge of these bridges. A lot of times when they built them, they threw half the tools away, it looks like, right over the edge of the deck. So you want to make sure you stay off the bottom a little ways so you don't get hung up in fishing line or anything else that might be down there. It's definitely something you want to think about before you jump in and do. A lot of times driving down the highway, they don't even realize they're going over a bridge. So <laughs> anytime there's water, we're out there making sure that the piers are safe, just to make sure that all our structures are, are safe for everybody to travel over every day.